Who famously kissed Paul Skulls? Oh. That was definitely me! Hey, that was definitely me! That was definitely me! That was definitely me! Welcome to the Manchester Derby face-off in partnership with Renault. Lovely job, Liz! Um, Out of you two, who will be the strongest in terms of football knowledge? I'm the strongest. You're the strongest? In every, every department. Wow. <laughs> And are you going to be taking on two Man City legends in a Manchester Derby quiz? How confident are you feeling about that? Yeah, I'm, I'm always pretty confident, to be fair. Always confident against City? Yeah, yeah. <laughs> if we don't win this, I'll be disappointed. Yeah, yeah. Really, I love that. Yeah, we're two pundits. We should know. Yeah, very we, good we, point. We should know very the information. Just adding, adding more pressure. It doesn't matter, we thrive <laughs> under pressure. <laughs> Start asking me scores for everyone. Yeah. Yeah. Start asking me years and I'm shrugging, I'm not even sure what year we're in now. <laughs> Besides me, I have four legends, two representing Man City and two representing Man United. I have a series of questions in front of me. The first team to buzz in will have a go to answer the question. If you get it right, you get a point. If you get it wrong, it will then go to the next team that get one attempt to answer the question. The team with the most points at the end will be the ultimate winner, representing Man United. We do have two legends indeed. Andy Cole and Wes Brown. Andy, can I hear your buzzer, please? <laughs> The worst buzzer there is. I feel like it's 1 0 City already. Uh, Wes Brown, your buzzer? Yeah, snitch. Okay. Please. <laughs> <laughs> snitch. The police over there. <laughs> we'll move on. Uh, representing Man City, uh, Michael Richards, let's hear your buzzer. Basically. Okay, yeah, yeah. and Jolyon Lescott. Now, that for me is, is a buzzer buzzer, isn't it? Yeah, there we go. Traditional. Um, are you all happy with the rules? Should yeah, we get yeah. straight into it? Let's go. Okay, first question. Who has made the most appearances in Manchester derbies? Oh, it was close, but Wes Brown was the first. Giggs there, Ryan Giggs. It is Ryan Giggs. It is a point to Man United. I, I, I was just about quick. to say that. So it's 1 0 Man United, Mikey. You're not happy with your buzzer? I'm not happy, mate. But we go on, we roll on. Okay, question two. Who is the all time top scorer in the Manchester derby? Manchester You're City. You're going to get this wrong, what? We've got to be. Rooney. It is Rooney! Oh, right. oh. <laughs> Okay, very quick, so it is one all tense. What was written on Balotelli's shirt when he... That's me. That's me, that's me. I'm a cameras. you got cameras. That's just louder. All right, freeze it, let's see it. Let's go back. What was written on Balotelli's shirt? So we've gone to a VAR replay, and it has been revealed that Man City buzz oh, oh, first. Oh, interesting. interesting. Uh, Mark, could you accept my apology? Yeah, it's so Okay, well, well, so you do get yeah, to go first. Yeah. What was written on Balotelli's shirt when he scored his first in the 6-1 win at Old Trafford? Do you want to say it, or do I? I don't know what you're going to say. No. <laughs> <laughs> why always me? It was why always me. It means Man City sailing to a 2-1 lead. Andy, you're not happy with the VAR? That sums up VAR, doesn't it? Okay. <laughs> Next up, we all know that Wayne Rooney scored that famous bicycle kick. Oh, Papa, you remember that one? Oh! <laughs> <laughs> hey, you keep showing replays on Sky. <laughs> to give United a 2-1 win, but who scored United's first goal? Andy Cole first to buzz in. Who scored it? That was the fourth game. Five, four, three, two, one. Is it Fletch? It wasn't Darren Fletcher, no. Ooh. Which means, Man City, you get an attempt. Who scored? Who scored for oh, Man United? Correct. Berbatov. It wasn't, it was Nani. There we go. Ooh. So it remains 2-1 to yeah, Manchester was... City. Ooh, well, these are easy questions. Right, which Premier League player has scored for both clubs in Manchester derbies? Michael Richards buzzed in first. Well, no, I'm not sure about that one, but... Five seconds but... again for... Terrace! It is Carlos Tevez! <laughs> Come on! <laughs> Come on! This next question is 3 1 Man City. Man United need a point here. Who famously kissed Paul Skulls? Oh. That was definitely me! Hey, that, was that, was that, was that was definitely me! That was definitely me! That was definitely me! Not doing that, but I'm just nice little. From behind the camera, I'm being told Man United buzzed first. So, who famously kissed Paul Skulls after the midfielder scored a late winner? Gary Neville. It was Gary Neville. It is 3-2. OK, now this is interesting because this is multiple choice. So don't forget, if you do buzz and get it wrong, it goes to the opposite team. Which player out of Claudio Bravo, Sergio Aguero and David Silva holds the most international caps? 
Andy Cole. I would go for... Two. <laughs> I, ah! I, I would go for what is that part you're up to? I believe it's uh, David Silva. It is David Silva. Yes, Cole, a bit. Great. Skill. <laughs> <laughs> I love that. That's longer than five. Great skills, Mandy yeah. Cole. It is three all. Okay. One of you may have an advantage to this. What was the year Wes Brown played his first ever Manchester derby? Could get this wrong, or wow. <laughs> 2002. It wasn't 2002. Oh! <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I, I know what it is then. How old are you? You are a similar age. I know what it is now. Go on, you've got, I'm you've got to guess. Anyway, 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 is it 2002? Right you guessed then. 2001. Incorrect. It's 2000. Yeah. There we go. He knows it now. So not even Wes Brown got a question right about Wes Brown. It's still three all. Who scored for City in Michael Richards' first ever Manchester derby? One goal scorer from Man City that day, Jodian Lescott. 2006, so it was, was that, oh my gosh. Got to push you. It was when I was like, three, three, two, Are you gonna guess? one, come on, need to take a guess. Sean Wright Phillips. It wasn't Sean Wright Phillips, which means Man United have a guess for the leaders. What year was it, Topper? Nah. No, I don't mate, it's 2000. I remember debut 2005. You'll give them it. If so he loses my, by my one. I think it was 2006, so 2006, yeah. Don't know. Not even going to have a guess. I don't know. That you said don't no, know. No, okay. That's the answer. All oh, right. Wow. <laughs> the answer is Hatem Trebelsi. Oh, oh, my God. Remember God. that? I don't remember that. No. Next question. Which class of 92 United player scored his first professional goal in a Manchester derby? Jolien Lescott. Right, you get this wrong. We'll get it. Run gigs. It is Ryan Giggs, yeah. yes. That's just the obvious one, isn't it? <laughs> it wouldn't obviously impress me. <laughs> Great point. <laughs> so it's currently Manchester City four, Man United three. This is Here tough enough It's a good quiz, isn't it? Who was the last player to score a hat-trick in the Manchester derby? Yeah. Oh, Jolien Lescott. So. Who else is it, can it be? Sergio Aguero. It isn't Sergio Aguero. When did he score a hat trick in the derby? When? At home. He scored one. This has got to be way back when. Wayne Rooney. It's not Wayne Rooney. Do you know it is Andre Kanchelskis. That's what I'm saying. Last it's way back player when. To way score back a hat trick. When? When is um, who scored more Manchester derby goals? Sergio Aguero or Eric Cantona? Manchester United. Aguero. It is Aguero, which means it is Man United 4, Man City 4. Wow. You were slack, I believe you didn't get that, man. How did you not get that? Too busy I knew it was Aguero. Yeah. Aguero for the last well, question. I didn't, know, I didn't know if he was going to say Rooney. <laughs> In the first Manchester derby match of the 2008-09 season, Cristiano Ronaldo received a red card, but why was he sent off? Andy Cole. It's a bad tackle. Incorrect. Descent. It wasn't descent, no. It was for that bizarre handball, do you remember? Taken in and he picked the ball up. You were involved in this. That he, he, he thought the whistle had gone, so he picked the ball up and the ref sent him off for a handball. You don't remember that at all? No, mate, I was concentrating on my job. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Great answer. Great answer. Okay. So it is for all. Who made more Manchester Derby appearances? Wes Brown or Micah Richards? Where's first to buzz in? Top, I don't know. <laughs> we don't know. We, don't, we <laughs> ain't got to know. We ain't got to know. I'll say me. Incorrect. Oh! <laughs> Which means the rules are straightforward. We played this from the start. It goes to the other team. No way. There's only one to get. Oh! Michael, would you like to say the answer? <laughs> it's got to be big me. It is. I'll run it. Wes Brown, 12. Micah Richards, 13. Ooh. With one question remaining. It's Manchester <laughs> City, 5. <laughs> Man United 4. The final question is, how many times did Peter Schmeichel lose a Manchester derby? Of course, he played famously for both clubs. We're going to go two. Incorrect. Oh, Which means, well played. Well played. Man City, do you want to guess? Five. Peter Schmeichel lost 
no Manchester derbies. Oh, yeah. Never lost a Manchester derby. We would have got that if we needed to. There you go. Oh, yeah. So the winners of the Manchester derby face-off with Renault are Manchester City. Listen, listen, we have to let them win some of it. Ouch! He was waiting for that. Yeah. He, he, he knew what he was doing. He knew what he was doing. Man City win the quiz. Man United win the argument. Yeah. <laughs>